Hey guys, how's it going? It's me, Mr. Ferrifel, and welcome back to the Sandman. This should be... The extra ones, I was like, no idea. The sound feels like... Oh, there, the sound is working. Sorry. Um, yeah, we're going to the next bonus one. These people are all move around. Did they say anything different? Okay, no, no, no difference. Ah, uh, never mind. It was a fair one last time. What's this one? Oh, Memory of the Sandman. View it. It's a new... Oh, God. Oh, yes, David. Oh, right. Oh, this is all, like, pictures from it. Okay. Okay. This is really weird. Oh, yeah, that was cool. Uh, yeah, this is, like, an extra bonus one, I think. I'm just going to have a look around. I don't know how long this is going to be. Can't escape the cage. Par Can't escape the cage. Paranoiac. I saw a man drowning in a test tube. Insanity. Wait, I don't know insanity. I think that oh, I think that was Yuri's first game, but it didn't really get an English version, apparently, I think. The Crooked Man. I think this must be Mirrored Swamp, then. A dream, cold, sand, underwater dream. Yeah, Mirrored Swamp. Okay. So these are the four games that he, or she even, has released up to this point. But I know that there's more. Last this school. Okay, what's up here? Oh no, that's... what's that down over there then? Oh, it's clicked up. I don't understand why it does that sometimes. It just taps me out the game. I don't know, both of them take it down. So is there nothing actually here? Theatre is showing a preview movie for the next game in the series. We give a low quality for the sake of file size. Ooh! Hang on, never mind. I watch a preview of the next game. Is that all? Theo show a preview of the upcoming suspense game. Did the last one say suspense? Oh fuck it, let's watch. Why not? I thought this was actual more game mode, but I don't know. The Madonna of the school is dead. Well. happening. Who killed her? I don't know. What is this game? <laughs> okay, I don't know what this is. Pedestal. Okay, I have another that one. Knowing the truth must be a very frightening thing. Oh. Okay, that was weird. What about this one then? Or is this the same thing? With the support of V G person and many of her assistants. Oh blame it on the sunshine. Don't blame it on the moonlight. Don't blame it on moonlight. Oh my god, don't blame it on the good times. Don't blame it on the good times. Oh blame it on the buggy. <laughs> Please say it. Blame it on the Oh yeah, Boogie Man. Boogie. Oh, I get it. Yeah, okay. Makes sense. <laughs> oh, yeah. What am I watching? <laughs> oh, it's lit. Literally, it's lit. Go to hell. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I 
Okay, well, uh, I just witnessed. Somebody stopped at asshole's calls. So, like, the first part, the big man was quite good, but that guy was kind of shit. Um, is that it? Is that all there is to this? I kind of hope not. Because I... Oh, well. I guess, yeah, I guess that is it. Oh, that's not a very good one. Hmm. Is there actually nothing else for me to do? I thought there would have been. Well, I guess that's it. So two uh, game trailers, but I would have thought there would have been more. I've gone through this, haven't I? Yeah, okay. Oh. oh, that's only lasted me six minutes. I, I don't know about this being an actual thing. Oh, well. Anything else I can do quickly. I don't want to... Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm trying to think. Okay. I remember what I was thinking. I guess I could get the buggy man. Um, and start that. Alongside the walking dead. Should we do that? You know what? Let's do that. Right, okay, so yeah, we're just jumping into the buggy man. I mean, it's, yeah. It's kind of a weird... Oh, this is weird. This is different. Ooh, I can change stuff. Um, let's just go for it. The trailer was kind of sick, actually. It's like had voice acting. The buggy man's one was cool. Oh, God, this is it. It's going... Wait, this is a horror game. It contains scares and grotesque content, so refrain from playing it if you feel you can't handle it. Please adhere to the following rules to prevent trouble. If these rules conflict with the rules of the office site, the rules on the site take priority, so check, please check. No repurposing resources except office illustrations. No redistribution of game files except for translations. No, uh, Do not cut the end credits from videos of the game. Did I do that for the Sandman? I don't know. I don't think I did. Um... Check the author's site for more information. Acknowledge the author takes no responsibility. Okay. I'm not gonna skip. Oh, is this gonna be the call from the um stuff? Ooh. Great voice acting already. Love it. Pull the mic a bit closer. Oh, I actually have to press enter. Oh god. Sorry. Yes. I mean, the cow is some guy in there. No, no. I was just thinking. I feel like I've heard this voice before. Somewhere. About what, sir? How's the suspect doing? Still not out yet. It's been three hours, so I'm sure he'll be here soon. Yeah. The voice of three yards for a second. I swear I've heard the other voice from probably some other game I've seen on YouTube, to be honest. But I've never seen this one. So. Anderson was groaning about it, you know, wondering what's even the point in calling you. They're Canadian, eh? Ah, sir, he's coming out. In the closet. Uh oh. What? <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> he's got a woman behind him. I think she came in after. You think she's with him? This isn't good. Won't be able to arrest a guy like this. Why not? Because we have a girl. I'll squad B and C. We'll get him in that alley up ahead. Hold on a second, sir. She might be a civilian. We should really wait until he's alone. And are you going to take responsibility oh, if he kills her? Yeah. Come on. You faggot. <laughs> oh, sorry, that's a really offensive word. Sorry. I don't know why I said that. Pew. To you too. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, what is this guy doing? Dick. The cold, ruthless detective shoots down yet another criminal. Civilian woman, forever traumatized. <laughs> we tried to ask Keith Baring, the detective responsible, to shed us some more light. Not even on the fucking text box. What is this game? Told us this. Is this the visitor's entrance is that way. 
it seems that he sees truth seekers like us as unwanted guests. Well, what do you know? It doesn't say a word about the criminal, nor that the woman was a prostitute, or how we took some injuries of our own in the gunfight. Reporters, Hamm I can read gossip myself. I don't need you reading it out loud. Okay, what is this game? Is this even the right game? Guys, this is a poor fire goal by my count. I'm jealous. Just tell me what you call me. I've got good news. I'm giving you a vacation. A vacation? Huh? Not a chance. We've no time to rest. There's too much I need to do. You've got a good lackey, right? Leave it to him. And stretch a with dick. I'm He's telling bad. you, there's no way. Dick. I'm ordering you as your superior. If you don't want to travel, consider it house arrest instead. But it's not. Why are they not on the screen? You aren't fit to bear the front of the media. I can handle the rest real well. So, go on, take a break from the crime scene. And hey, they come back. But I didn't say you have to twiddle your thumbs at home for a month, right? Here's a little present, okay. There's this old castle they're promoting as a tourist spot. There's a sort of test run tour two weeks from now. Truth is, me and the wife were gonna go, but I say you do it. How many years has it been for you two? Helena will be ecstatic. Now, okay. put down the gun and the notebook. We'll need them on vacation. Right. Boring. Oh. Today, you can hand over your work tomorrow. Is this is that is this actually the right game? Enough of the blaring music here in the hallway. It's a fair point. It's quite. So it's about. Based on his own game. Oh no. I'm actually curious. Is this the right game? Someone else just pawned this off. How was work? Same as usual. You look tired. Are you alright? I'm fine. Oh yes. I get a fantastic present from Mr. Anderson's flight. Mr. Anderson? Is that Neo from the Matrix? She's short. Look at these, honey. They're invitations. A three day stay at an old castle. Won't that be wonderful? Dick already told me. Gave me some time off first. Sorry if I'm skipping it. It's just well, weirding me out. If you aren't too tired, I'd like to go myself. What do you think? If you're going, then I'm going. I'll tell our travel agent. Thanks, honey. I can't wait. Oh, I really don't like these voices. I've got some work to take care of. Go to bed without me. Night. Good night. I think one that's a bit creeped. Huh. Woo! Um. Should I talk to people? I'll talk to you. Okay, I can't talk to anyone. What the fuck? Uh, through a large window, you can see the sun setting over the sea. The ferry is anchored. Oh, here we go. I've been waiting for you. I'm Stevie Small, the tour conductor. I'll be your guide for this tour. I thought it was a girl. Now that you two are here, all the attendees are present. Please come aboard. We'll be leaving in roughly 30 minutes. Okay. Roughly 30 minutes. Okay, I'm actually a bit creeped. But I actually need to check, I think, at some point if this is the right game. Hello. Can I pause? I'm going to go oh, sh sorry. To the others. What about you? I'll head you can skip through that button as well. Okay, I, I... I actually need to find out if this is the right game. Which means system? Okay, this doesn't seem right. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, from what I saw, it seems to be the right thing. So, I mean, I guess we'll just carry on. Traveling bag, a uh, little safe or fridge, refrigerator. There are drinks and ice inside. But, let's do it. Let's just. Fuck. Oh, hello. Don't just swing the door open like that. Be more careful. You're not going to be thingy, are you? Try looking where you're going. I already forgot a name. Maybe you should look where you're going yourself, old man. Nasty tongue on you, huh? You bet. I was. Oh, she's born with a nasty tongue. Hey now, 
It is Sophie, for fuck's sakes. <laughs> I knew, why are you here? It's not the voice I give her. Come now, apologize. I'm sorry. I'll be more careful from now on. Okay. Old man. Well, she was not nasty though in the other one. Let's get some ice cream at the lounge. My apologies for that. Is she your daughter? Yes. She's my one and only precious. Full of energy, that's for sure. Oh yes. She's very excited for the trip to now. See, this other guy sounds quite good. This just this actor's awful, I think. Excitement is one thing. But you try to get her to stop yelling at people over little near collisions. If she talks to the wrong guy, it could be trouble. I wish that the bloody text boxes were in the plea. I think it's thing. much better than keeping all her dissatisfaction to herself. Oh yeah, that was the problem in the Sandman. I'm Richard Grumler. That was my daughter, Sophie. Glad to meet you. Keith Berry. Did you come alone? No, it's my wife. Oh, wonderful. I hope we both have a great trip. David's gonna be here. David's gonna be here with Shelly or whatever her name was. Is there a way I can go on the system and you repeat now? Just memory. I think battle hold. Um, no, there's nothing on here about it, is there? Have I got any items? No. Okay. Right, let's just carry on. Ooh. Well, there they are. Um, I straight away see her. Wait, is that my missus? I don't know. This is bloody thingy. Yep, Shirley. Do it. I'm Shirley Weber. She came here with her husband. Oh, yes. Where is he now? He told me he went to take a smoke, so he might be up on the deck. Oh, God, I'll go find him. Hey, what's with the suit? You're on vacation, you know. Oh, Crime never stops, lady. You're with the men in black? Sorry, but I don't have sunglasses. Or a neuralizer. <laughs> oh, yeah, bring out the pop references. Let's enjoy our trip, shall we? Yep, I'm gonna go find David. Yes. Need a light? David's voice is weird. Thanks. Oh. Well, this is weird. Nice weather today, don't you agree? I already know it's David. Stop with the question marks. Sure is. To tell you the truth, it's my first time traveling on a ship, and it's really exciting for me. I'm just glad it's so nice out. Certainly wouldn't be out smoking on the deck here if it were raining. Shouldn't be smoking anyway, David. Fucking idiot. Keith Barry. David Hoover. Detective, huh? Very cool. I always like to watch those police dramas. But why the suit? Old habits. Never been on a ship except for the job. Ah, okay. Did you come alone? No, I came with my wife. Oh, they're married now. That's good. I to invite some friends along, another couple, but... The husband ended up in the hospital. What, Paul ended up in hospital? Came down with something. I remember the name. He ruined his stomach from eating too many chili dogs. Always been kind of a moron. So I invited my mother <laughs> and her father. They were always saying they didn't get to go on vacation often. Oh yeah, they didn't. They never went. The Grumblers. Right. They were both really pleased. I'm glad I invited them. Too bad about my friends, though. Enjoy yourself in their place, then. <laughs> yep, that's the plan. Yeah, okay. Now I'm seeing why they're here, but Oh, another smoke? No. Oh. Alright, in a bit, David. Um Does he hear still like you like tea? Absolutely. What about you? Sorry, I can't stand this stuff. Okay. It's this way. Okay, I don't know you. Keith Barrett. Who could have guessed I'd be graced by the presence of the tabloid star? Okay, I don't know who this guy is. I'm Lance Canal. So what brings you here? Murder on the ship? Unless it's someone from like the movie Swamp or that insanity. Yourself, detective. Then maybe, but I I, don't, I haven't played those. Don't say that. These tabloids who rag on you come from the same publisher I work for. That's all it is. I'm here to take pictures. Heard there was a new tourist trap. Okay. They invited me here for publicity. Don't you worry. <laughs> this guy's voice is weird as well. Why are they all so randomly like, don't worry? For a humble travel magazine. Not like I'm one of those paparazzi guys. Still, 
don't have to take pictures to get material. I can make some good money passing things on to my gossip writing colleague. Yeah. Good luck with that. I don't like him. I'll be watching, detective. That sounds really sinister and really weird at the same time. Um, <laughs> you'd be watching me. Alright, anyway. Is this the castle? Oh yeah. my gosh, look at the size of that. It's fantastic. Oh, thank you. <laughs> it really is. I can't wait to take a look inside. Okay, that's weird. Don't want to look inside there. Man, it's like the kind of place would be a murder case on an old cop show. Oh, you're talking about the castle? Ah, okay. Stop being such an oddball. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get it. You're telling us we have to camp out in front for this tour. That's odd. I'm sure I told him when we'd arrive. Hold on a moment. Yeah, that is odd. Hello. That's a great Stevie thing. From NA Travel. <laughs> Hello, Brendan. Are you there? Oh, this is part of the experience, I reckon. Is everybody ready? I'm the Boogeyman. Nigel, your tie's crooked. Fix it. Mitch, your hair's a mess. Matt. Glasses were... Well, they're still aim. No, burn! <laughs> That's laughing. Well, Matt. Welcome, welcome. I've been waiting for you. I'm Brendan Dumont, the proprietor of this castle. Stevie, I thought you'd never come. Thanks for leading them here. And thank you for showing up, Brendan. I was worried you weren't. Oh, I should. Oh, sorry, I keep cutting off. There's no need, Stevie. I'm already well aware of our guests. Mr. Lance, the Grumblers, Mr. David, and Mr. Shirley, and last but not least, the Barings. We well, shouldn't David like have a last name. They came from Sandy Anderson. <laughs> what a delight! Why don't you like those? Guy. You take care of this place all by yourself? Yes, that's right. You must be tired from that long boat ride. I'll lead you to your rooms inside. You'll be Ooh. alone until dinner, so make yourself at home. Okay. I will make myself at home. Thank you very much. So wonderful from here. It's like we're back in Europe. You remember when we went to France and you? I. Ah, oh, I gave her the Eiffel Tower. I reckon. Can't you answer that? Well, I just don't answer phones. I'll call it back. Yeah, fuck Eric. I wonder what the others are up to. I'll go take a look. Okay. Say it a bit. I was just smoking my room. Are you coming? Not right now. Later. Oh, Mean. Yeah, that'll get, go right now. This is like, gonna be like a big game of Cluedo. Or Clue if you are American. A landscape painting. Ooh. Which way? This way. Oh, they've still got the dodgy stairs. Definitely the right game. Oh, hello. Wow, even this hall is huge. You can't to dance. I somehow find people. Perhaps we should have brought some nice dresses for you. Hey, let's take a picture of me and Papa, will you? Eh? Sorry, I, I don't do people. Ask a friend if you want a photo, Missy. <laughs> Cheapo. Hmm. <laughs> I got a camera? Wait. I got a cell phone. I'll do it. Don't play around with the stairs like that. You'll trip and fall. Oh, thanks for the concern. Not to worry, old man. I'm causing you trouble. I'd be appreciative, young lady. Just turn around. Detective, out of the frame. I got a job to do here, you know. Sure are enthusiastic, Doug. Don't need any pics of you. Thought I told you I'm not a gossip kind of guy. Uh, no, you said the opposite, actually. This really is quite the impressive castle. No doubt it'll draw many tourists once it's opened up. Why, I could even see it being used as a movie set. Maybe. So wouldn't that mean the tourists go, well, what the fuck are you doing, dude? He's playing piano. Really? Good detective work. I actually can't go upstairs yet. Okay. Cheers, Sophie. Dickhead. Okay, the last hall is locked. Oh, shit. 
lost again. You're awful at this. It's getting a bit boring. No, you're just too good. Your poker face especially. Yeah, <laughs> it probably doesn't help that you're grinning or grimacing at every hand. Am I right or what, Helena? David is probably pretty useless at this. It's really quite cute, though. Uh, uh, <laughs> excuse me. Can I play? Playing poker with us, honey. Yeah. Oh, you're joking. Oh, I just can't win. Glad I'm not betting any money. And would you like to play king? I would. Uh, too bad. I have a feeling you're great at poker. Uh, yes. Guess we'll never know. The oh. plan is to tour the castle in the morning, then go around town in the afternoon. The car will be here to pick us up at one. Ah. Okay. What time does it make lunch? I don't know. Good to me. All right. It does to me too. Employees. Hi, Mr. Barry. Are you enjoying yourself? Take a look anywhere. I don't mind. I know, I know. It's a terribly large place. Okay. And you? Oh, Mr. Barry. Here's the menu for dinner tonight. Anything that needs changing? Any allergies? My wife won't eat meat. Can you change the main course? Understood. I'll tell the cook. Will she be all right with fish? Sure. And how about dessert? You have Ooh. your choice of cheesecake, grass jelly, or... Grass jelly? What the fuck's grass jelly? What kind of cheesecake is it? Rare. Hmm. Like it baked it. It's a rare it's cheesecake. And tea for after the meal. Chamomile if you can. I'll have to see. Certainly, sir. <laughs> you know your wife's taste so well. Personally, I'm so forgetful. Oh, you're useless. I brought some Casablancas home for her, and she told me she hated them. Just have to remember every little detail for next time. Absolutely. Every little detail seems a bit bad. Right, to be honest with you, I think that'll do for that one. If I go so much this is a new one with weird voice acting which confuses me because I don't know what to say during the time. But uh, yeah, oh well. Hopefully this will be decent and the buggy man will show up, yes. <laughs> but uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you join the next video. Okay, bye guys. Bye.